Welcome back to Plane Pro. So you have seen the top 10 worst airlines here. But what about those awful aggravated airports that we have all experienced? Well, take a seat, buckle in as we fly down the top 10 worst airports ever. As always, we'll be ranking these airports from bad to worst. So stay tuned. Confusing its customers, it's number 10, Gatwick Airport, London. The UK's second largest airport, long distance walk into the gates, dirty lounges and crowded waiting areas, poorly designed and confusing signage. One passenger referring it to a Lego brick house designed by a child. Time for a rebuild. Hangry passengers at number 9, Billy Bishop, Toronto. Also referred to as Toronto Island Airport. It seems you are deserted here after going through its tunnel to get to the airport. It is simply too small for comfort. You will find a complete lack of food and beverage options. Passengers frequent complaints being incredibly poor customer service. What's that smell? Number 8, Porto Airport, Portugal. Their main problem here seems to be sewage related issues with dirty, clogged up toilets, poor signage with a very limited food and beverage range, described as below average. Bonjour Paris, number 7, Paris Orly Airport in Paris. It seems they have quite the opposite problem of Billy Bishop Airport. Plenty of food on offer here, but you are going to need some extra euros to dine here. Overpriced, expensive food with rude staff seem to be a common thing. Mayhem in Manchester, number 6, Manchester Airport, United Kingdom. Drop off fees are sky high here, £6 for a 10 minute wait. After 10 minutes, the price skyrockets to £25. Other complaints include cars being broken into and in 2018, a waiting room ceiling collapsed. Make sure you don't miss our other videos here at Plane Pro and give us a little clickety click. Service without a smile, in at number 5, Bolter International Airport. This overcrowded airport cannot seem to keep track of its customers' luggage, no communication, poor quality customer service, and the management here described as slimy, smoking up a stink. Number 4, Henry Kwanda Airport, Romania. Airport lounges are reported to be filthy dirty, old and tatty. Delays pretty much every day. Bad lack of signage and encroaching designated smoking areas throughout the terminal. There are dozens of taxi towers too, ready to rip you off. Get into line, it's number three, Eindhoven Airport, Netherlands. No one likes waiting in queues, but if you do, make sure you fly out of here. Snaking lines of passengers are constant, missed flights and medical emergencies, with people fainting because of the waiting times. Checking desks and security checkpoints closed, ignorant staff and management described as a bunch of amateurs. Hell on earth. Number 2, Kuwait International Airport. Where shall we start with this one? Airport staff described as racist and rude with no values or ethics. Passengers belongings being confiscated and kept by staff. Congestion inside and outside of this airport is a complete disaster. Broken and missing signage. Facilities including toilets and eating areas littered with rubbish, rock and grime. It's hotting up at number 1, Lisbon Airport, Portugal. Lack of seating throughout, business lounges compared to school cafeterias, disorganised staff and management, little to no signage, passengers luggage being stolen. During summer months the airport is stifling hot with no air conditioning, airport layout described as a maze, overpriced food and drink, the place is a chaotic mess that could only be best described as a <laughs> What do you think of our top 10 worst airports? Who do you change on our list? Thank you for watching, watch more of our videos here and subscribe for the latest.